Good day students, I'm Mark Mendoza, I can call Mr. M. Let's mark up your math skills today. For this video, we will be studying limits of logarithmic functions. And what are logarithmic functions? Logarithmic functions are the inverses of exponential functions. Therefore, the inverse of the exponential function y is equal to b raised to x is equal to f of x is the logarithm of x to the base b, where b is not equal to 1 and greater than 0. To further explain this, let us have the following graphs and table of values. Let us consider the logarithmic function f of x is equal to the logarithm of x to the base 2. The graph and the table of values show that as x increases, the value of y increases. The same behavior is also shown in the graph of f of x is equal to the logarithm of x to the base 3, as well as the graph of f of x is equal to the logarithm of x to the base 4. Now let me give you a summary of the properties of the graphs of y is equal to logarithm of x to the base b, where b is greater than 1. It is a one-to-one -one function. The domain is a set of all real numbers greater than 0. The range is all real numbers. Vertical asymptote is a y-axis. Therefore, there is no y-intercept. The x-intercept is equal to 1, which means that the graph passes through the point 1, 0. The graph is increasing from left to right, which indicates that as x increases, y also increases. Let us take a look at the graph of y is equal to the logarithm of x to the base 2 and compute for the following. The limit of the logarithm of x to the base 2 as x approaches positive infinity is equal to positive infinity. The limit of the given function as x approaches 0 from the right is equal to negative infinity. The limit as x approaches 1 is equal to 0. The limit as x approaches 2 is equal to 1. And the limit of the logarithm of x to the base 2 as x approaches 4 is equal to 2. If b is greater than 1, then the limits of the logarithmic function f of x is equal to the logarithm of x to the base b are the following. As shown in the graph, the limit of the logarithm of x to the base b as x approaches positive infinity is equal to positive infinity. The limit as x approaches 0 from the right is equal to negative infinity. The limit of the logarithm of x to the base b as x approaches 1 is equal to 0. And the limit as x approaches a is equal to f of a, which is also equivalent to the logarithm of a to the base b, where a is in the domain of f. On the other hand, let us consider the logarithmic function f of x is equal to the logarithm of x to the base 1 half. The graph in the table of values show that as the value of x increases, the value of y decreases. The same behavior is also shown in the graph and table of values of the following functions. f of x is equal to the logarithm of x to the base 1 fourth, and f of x is equal to the logarithm of x to the base 1 over 8. And let me give you a summary of the properties of the graphs of the logarithmic function f of x is equal to the logarithm of x to the base b if b is between 0 and 1. The graphs of the properties of y is equal to the logarithm of x to the base b where b is between 0 and 1 are almost the same with the properties where b is greater than 1, except for the last one which states that the graph is decreasing from left to right, meaning as x increases, y decreases. Analyzing the graph of the logarithm of x to the base 1 half, let us compute for the following limits. The limit of the logarithm of x to the base 1 half as x approaches positive infinity is equal to negative infinity. The limit of the given function as x approaches 0 from the right is equal to positive infinity. The limit as x approaches 1 is equal to 0. The limit as x approaches 2 is equal to negative 1. And the limit as x approaches 4 is equal to negative 2. If b is between 0 and 1, then the limits of the logarithmic function f of x is equal to the logarithm of x to the base b are the following. The limit of the logarithm of x to the base b as x approaches positive infinity is equal to negative infinity. The limit of the given function as x approaches 0 from the right is equal to positive infinity. The limit as x approaches 1 is equal to 0. And the limit as x approaches a is equal to f of a, which is equal to the logarithm of a to the base b, where a is in the domain of f. 
And here's the summary of our discussion for today. Thank you for watching this video and I hope you learned something today. Watch out for my next videos.